Skadoosh, skadoosh. Welcome back to the channel, ninjas. Joey Moss with Bad Boy Gaming. And I just want to say, um, thank you for tuning in. I appreciate all of your guys' views. Uh, as you know, there were some giveaways a couple weeks ago. I'm a little behind. I'm sorry. I'm tardy to the party. All right. But that's just how it is. What I'm going to be giving away in this video is the Thoughtseize and Ancestral Vision from the first dual box opening video of Ultimate Masters. I asked you guys a question. Uh, that question was, tell me about your best pool story. And uh, I would pick two people at random to win. And uh, that's it. So, simple enough. I will announce those two winners. They're on the back of these cards. And I'll share their pool story with you guys sometime throughout this video. Meanwhile, we have an Ultimate Masters booster box to open. Yes, we purchased an entire case. And this is the last uh, two boxes. I'll do one today and one tomorrow. And don't fear. What about that Tarmogoyf, Mr. Moss? You promised us all a Tarmogoyf. You sawed it in half. That is very true, Jim. And guess what, Jimbo? I plan to deliver. Tomorrow, I will be announcing the winner of the Tarmogoyf and also these two booster packs of Ultimate Masters. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Please, by all means, make sure you hit the like button. It helps a lot, especially when I'm giving away stuff for free. Uh, if you could take one second just to hit the like button, because uh, believe it or not, shipping is a, uh, it does take a little bit of time. All right, let's get into this. Ultimate Masters, baby. Ultimate Box Topper. Man, that looks familiar. I remember destroying one of those. Weird. All right. Let's get some good pulls. Good luck. Good luck to me. Oh, yeah. These packs. I, I, I remember now how goofy these packs can be to open. Let me move my trash can. The old trash receptacle. Coming around the bend. There's my trash can. My best friend. My only friend. I swear, my, my trash can is my only friend. Um, it, it is undeniably loyal at all times. Raging Ravine. Mmm, this is going to be a sweet box, you can just tell. Desperate Ritual and the Worm. And we're really hoping to pull uh, nothing good. Because if we pull nothing good, then we're doing all right. Let's see what we get up in here. Shoutouts to Tristan Turner, Brian Kuhn, 17zilla, Christopher Carter, or Cartier, Ronald Dowling, and Sebastian Saylor, my ninjas. Daybreak Cornell. Cor Coronet, Daybreak Coronet, there you go, with a couple uh, uncommon cards. And shout outs to Eric Fuhrman, John Higby, Chris Nelson, Dylan Lake, Death Eagle, and Arn Agle. You guys are my super squad ninjas. You get a big skadoosh. Elemental Phyrexian Tower foil deck, it's a skadoosh all up in it, yeah. Loving it, nice foil hit right there. And a Light from the Loam, probably a bulk card. I uh, never heard of it before. Eternal Witness, though, that's pretty cool. And a Blast of Genius. That's a really good card. Not bad. Not bad at all. Too bad we hit uh, that Light from the Loam, though. Oh, well. You can't always get a winner every time you're up to bat, guys. I, I try telling you this all the time, you know. Last Gasp. Oof. Back to Basics. Nice. Nice. That's really nice. Back to Basics. This card was at 80 bucks. Or it was at, uh, it was at 200 uh, Counter Scroll is good card too. When uh, it first hit the scene, the foil version of it was at 200 bucks. Of course, that was an inflated price. Then it dropped all the way down to 60 bucks, and it wasn't until recent that it started climbing back up. It's at about 80 dollars right now. I don't know if that's a card maybe to invest in. I don't think we're gonna see a reprint of Back to Basics anytime soon. Call me crazy. Uh, back in the operation, Desolate Lighthouse. That is really cool. That is such a cool card. Uh, Rally the Peasants and a Ghoul Steed. I like the artwork on that Ghoul Steed, though. That is really good. I do like the artwork on that Ghoul Steed. I do not like these packs. Sam, I am. I do not like these packs if they were colored in crayon. That did not rhyme at all. Angel of Despair foil. Pretty cool. Engineered Explosives. Could have done better. And a Slippery Boggle. I remember destroying a Slippery Boggle. Dang. I can't believe it. And a foil foil. I've pulled two foil foils, I'll have you know. How many foil foils have you pulled? How many foil foils have you pulled that were foiled? I guess I guess they would have to be foiled. I guess they'd be foiled to be foiled. I'm not trying to foil you here. We got a ooze token with a wicker bow elder. And an Urborg tomb of Yogmith. Nice. This box is heating up pretty good. I must say, we got uh, quite a few good pulls here. Not bad at all. Ooh, I like how it opened like that. I don't appreciate the pull tab. That's all I'm saying. Last time I'll say it. Martyr of Sands. Mailstorm Pulse. Not bad. We're looking for a case hit. I have seen some videos where people pulled two rare 
Uh, actually, I pulled two rare foils and a, a foil mythic in one box. So those kind of boxes are out there. And uh, I've also seen some pretty crazy stuff come out of cases. Uh, a Gadok Teague foil. That guy looks like someone. Looks like someone creepy, I know. Hmm. Can't put my finger on it. Vexing Devil. Nice. And a Kitchen Finks. Brawn. There it is. Got the good old Brawn. Wasn't Bra No, Brawn was not a rare. Was Brawn a rare at one point? Might be confusing with another card. I'm sure I am. I usually walk around confused in life. Faith's Fetters. And a Flagstones of Trocare. All right. All right, all right. Calm down. Nothing too crazy. Uh, let me just pause right there. Let's announce uh, the winner. One of these winners. Uh, for the Ancestral Vision. Who's taking home the Ancestral Vision? Guys, it was completely random. Uh, but um, I, I read the story and I thought it was kind of... It, it was cute. It was nice. It was a good pull. Whatever. You know, all the, all the stories were, were great. Thank you, everyone, for sharing. Uh, Matty Maddo. He says... Best pull of my life. I went to my first draft event two weeks ago. I lose every single game except for the last one where I become a uh, friend with my opponent and we settle for a draw. Both beginners and both lost all previous games, by the way. Long story short, he says, which is funny. Draft is ending and the organizers mess up the booster prizes. So there is one remaining booster and everyone at our table already got at least one pack except for us. My new friend is in the bathroom, and they gave me a booster. Uh, they gave me the booster. <clears throat> uh, first thing I thought was to say, no, I want to wait for him to get out of the bathroom so we can split the pack. When he comes, I tell him, dude, we got lucky. This is for us. Let's split it. What a good guy. Choose two colors for the rare, and I'll do the same. He chooses green and white. I've been playing black and blue since we used to play in high school, so the choice is obvious. Plus, I've been desperately looking for a Doom Whisperer the whole night. No one had it for trade nor sale. We go through the pack. And skadoosh! Pack fresh Doom Whisperer. I jump smiling. People are speechless. My friend? Well, he said it was fair and happy for me. We are still friends today. That's awesome. I like that you made a friend through magic. I think that's amazing. Matt. Maddie Matto, congratulations. Ancestral Vision. Make sure you email me at mossbergswerve at gmail.com. That's M-O-S-B-E-R-G-S-W-E-R-V-E -E -E at gmail.com. Appreciate it, my ninja. Yeah, cool story. Um, I liked it because I had a friend once, and I thought that was nice. Uh, Resurrections of Foil. Spoils from the Vault. I, I still haven't looked the price up on that card. I don't know what it's worth. I pull it all the time. I think it's maybe like a dollar. It's got to be bulk rare, I'm assuming. I would imagine it's nothing too special. We got a Drake token, followed by a Miming Slime. I think I pulled three of these already. The foil version. Reanimate. Nice. Salad. Salad. Very salad. Have we pulled any Mythics yet? I'm starting to wonder. Did we pull any Mythics yet? I don't know if we did. We have not pulled a single mythic. That is, that's weird. Let's pull a car and call it a day, you know? I just want to get a car out of here. Liliana's cool, but, I mean, I mean, yeah, that's the biggest, I think it's the biggest hit is Liliana, but let's just get a car. Or, you know, we can just pull one of these. Skadoosh! Oh, man, hits the foil. I'm cool, the iron's torn. What do you want from me? My ears are ringing. Wow. And the old emissary of trust. We asked for a mythic. This only happens to Joy Moss, by the way. And not only do we pull a case hit, but then right after, uh, we pull another mythic in the same box. Get lost, man. Get lost. Don't find your way back home. Holy crap. That was cool. That was really, really cool. I was not expecting that. Just kidding. The whole thing's rigged. Everything you watch on this channel is fake. Uh, I set it all up, and I say stuff, and then boom, right there, I have the pack ready to go. That's how we do it here. Dawn Charm. We're a stirring wildwood. Eh, you know, hmm, it's the better one, I suppose. And the Chainer's Addict. That card was at, like, four bucks. I think it dropped to, like, two now. I could be wrong. But I doubt it. Oh, not one of these packs. I'm not using the pool tab. I refuse, man. I've seen some battle wounds and scars using that pool tab, guys. I don't recommend that to anybody. Uh, we got the Archomancer. Goryo's, uh Goryo's Vengeance. Pretty cool. Also, if you guys are going to be uh, on Twitch tonight, or if you never even watched Twitch before, go to twitch.com. And, uh, yeah, get on there. 
It only takes a second to register, but I'll be uh, live streaming some gameplay tonight. It shall be fun. Make sure you join. I get a little crazy on camera, let me tell you. Magma foil. I hate that. Visions of beyond. I don't know. Visions of why the hell was this printed? That's the only vision I have right now. I don't know if you guys have that vision, but I have that vision. And uh, there you go. It's a vision. Homunculus. Cool name, dude. Your mother did not like you. Kodama's Reach foil. And it sees the day is our rare. So we don't get another mythic um, until I start talking about one. So let's talk about a mythic. Let's just go ahead and pull one out. What do you say, guys? Sounds good. Phyrexian Tower. I tried to be clever and slick. My abilities have failed me. Phyrexian Tower is a good card, though. And the hero. Hero of gorgeousness. That's what that is. We are down just a few packs to crack. What's the gonna be, Captain? I wonder what's in our ultimate topper. That'd be cool. Eternal Witness foil. That's a really good uncommon foil to have. And a awesome tower in Sky Summoner. That, that was really cool. Spike. Back here. That's a, that's a really sad story. Let's open up this ultimate box topper. Get some luck, baby. May luck be on my side forever and ever. Forever and today. Oh, I can't really see that. My name is Joey Moss. I don't know how to open a pack. <laughs> Hello, everyone. My name is Joey Moss. I can't open a pack. So our next pack, hopefully we get something good out of this one. Uh, maybe we'll get maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe we'll pull the old Liliana to make up for that piece of shit pool I just had. Freaking bullshit. Uh, Whirlwind Adept and a Bitter Blossom. Yay! I wanted you, but I want you in the Masterpiece Foil. That's all a brother asked for. That's all I asked for. But that's really cool. That card is going up in price steadily. I think it's at 32 right now. Not too bad. Uh, let's get into the other wiener in just a second. We're going to crack this open as well. Hmm, isn't that fun? Yes, isn't that fun? Let's see. We got the worm. The Ronam Unicorn foil. Dark Depths. There's another mythic. What's this? Four mythics in this box? Now that's impressive. That is just impressive. Is that four mythics? I think so. Yeah, we got that. That. What else? That. Yeah, so we got four mythics. That, my friends, is amazing. Including that foil. Can we get five mythics? I don't think there's been a five mythic ultimate moos ultimate ultimate boosters. Ultimate Masters booster box. Gadok Teague, the non-foil version, really cool. I'm telling you, the sleight of hand is nice. These boxes, <clears throat> they're gonna be 500 bucks uh, within two years. There's that's just how it's gonna be. So if, if for everyone's like, it's too much to pay, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it is too much to pay, but it's a premium product, and it is what it is. And you're getting premium cards that are really sought after. And uh, they did a great job with this set. Pattern of Rebirth. So if you didn't get in on it um, during pre-release or even now, if you don't buy a box now, uh, don't complain when they're 500 bucks a pop. That's all I'm saying. Don't complain when they're 500 bucks a, a, a pop. They're, they're going to be. No if, ands, or buts. The Awful Snot. Woodfall Primus. So we go out with a skadink. That's all right. We got the Druid in the end. And uh, the person who won. The Thought Seas from Iconic Masters. Nice card. This person said, My best pool. I was walking around Walmart and grabbed three random packs. Throughout my shopping, I put them down a couple times because I was basically broke. I have... I haven't and bought them. I, I have them and bought them anyways. Uh, I opened them once I got to my car and pulled a Karn and Tefiri from two Dominaria packs and a foil Crucible of Worlds. I sat there for 10 minutes and just said, no shit. That person is Black Cobra. Congratulations to you two. Uh, please, by all means, make sure you message me so I can get or uh, email me at mossbergswerve at gmail.com. That's M O S B E R G. S W E R V E at gmail.com. And uh, I need your address. I need to know your name. That's about it, man. All right. Appreciate you guys tuning in, as always. Hug a donkey.